Hey guys, just wanted to do a quick video with you uh, for a review on my Rothko tactical vest. There's obviously a lot of choices on the market for tactical vests and choosing one's kind of difficult sometimes, especially if you have to, you know, buy one online if you live in a rural area. Uh, fortunately, I had a army surplus store near me that carried tactical vests and had a few different options, uh, different uh, price starting variants and different configurations. Ultimately, out of the, I think, four or five choices that I had, I did go with this one. Ran me about $70. It is by Rothko, which is a well-named um, Army Military Surplus Company. Um, very nice jacket, well-made. It's got a lot of pockets and stuff on here. I'll just kind of briefly go through it with you. As you can see, it is a nice padded material or mesh padded material. Um, it is a real durable. Uh, if you could feel it, it's, it's like a nylon almost. Uh, so it will definitely hold up. Uh, it's got the zipper in the front as well as some clipping buttons to keep it secured. With the additional weight that you might have in the pockets, that's definitely helpful. It did along the bottom have these um, belt holder and it came with this kind of a utility belt. I personally didn't like the utility belt on there. kind of felt like it weighted me down and it didn't really sit in a position that I liked it. So nice enough that you're able just to take that off. Unfortunately, do have these things that just kind of hang there, which isn't a huge deal. Uh, on the left hand side here on the inside, you will actually have a pocket, a mesh pocket here where you're able to hold some stuff. That's got a zipper there. Um, on the left hand outside, you do have two large magazine pouches, generally AR-15, M16 type magazine pouches. Uh, I'm sure AK-47, 30 round mags would also fit in there. So you got two of those. Uh, you do have on the upper pocket here, just one large pocket and that's generally used for you know any kind of supplies, medical supplies or uh, hunting supplies that you would bring with you or anything else that you'd really want to throw in there. I usually throw some 22 ammunition in there if I'm going uh, small game hunting. Uh, that's it for the left hand side. The one thing I would make note about this particular vest is all of this stuff is permanently affixed to this vest. So there are some vests out there where it will let you take these things off and you know put on different accessories and different pouches to whatever configuration you would like which would be really nice. Um, but this one is permanently affixed to here. So if you're looking for something that's going to be a bit more modular I would definitely recommend looking for something else. On the right hand side and along the top you do have smaller pouches here and these can be used for any kind of pistol uh, magazines. Um, my 9mm fits well in there. Uh, that also works for or, um, uh, flashlights I should say, mace, anything really that's got kind of a long um, small tubular type um, shape to it. And then along the bottom right hand side what you'll have here is the actual uh, carry case for your medium to large frame pistol. It should fit uh, all medium sized pistols, medium frame pistols, uh, and most large frame pistols. Although I'm sure you'd probably have a tight squeeze if you get a large 1911 you're trying to squeeze that in there. Uh, it does have a nice holster, it does a fix in there real well, nice and tight. It's got a nice uh, clip that goes over the top to secure your gun into that position. It also has an additional magazine pouch right there on the uh, top of the holster. Again this this particular uh, holster is the only thing that is not affixed to the actual vest. So I'm able to remove this holster and adjust it upwards or downwards on this uh, right bottom hand side of the vest and uh, or completely remove it and replace it with something else. And I'm sure that would be handy for any of you that uh, you know have a specific holster that works well with your with your uh, pistol. Uh, this vest here as you can see I'm not sure if you're able to see underneath it but it is lined with four stripes of um, kind of a velcro-ish type strap material and you can actually slide any kind of holster rings through there and again move that up or down however you need it to be. Um, it does again also have on the right hand side and the inside another mesh pocket. Uh, this, this vest is uh, a large size. I think they do have a few different sizes available um, but you're able to adjust this um, pretty considerably uh, to small or large depending on you know what's more com most comfortable for you. Along the right hand side you do have uh, adjustments kind of like a life or a, you know a life preserver or something like that. You got just those general kind of strap that you can pull tight. Um, and then along the top 
you do have some paracord rings there and the shoulders can actually be adjusted with these velcro you can make it smaller or, or uh, larger depending on if you have a larger sh or smaller shoulder base uh, so that's real nice it's really adjustable um, along the top it does have one life-saving uh, velcro grab for when you need to grab someone and pull someone out of something um, I don't know I'm kind of mixed on that obviously if you're able to grab somebody and pull it it's gonna make kind of a um, easy way for someone to grab you and kind of hold you down so um, that's kind of a mixed emotions on that and then the rear is I uh, got a bunch of velcro area here if you are a member of law enforcement or any other kind of uh, agency where you're able to plaster uh, your agency tag on the back there uh, I'm sure they have the velcro adhesive ones for your tags that you can just kind of throw right on there and it does have more additionally uh, some of these um, areas where you're able to add again modular things uh, maybe additional pockets etc magazine pockets uh, for anything else that you want to hold so overall great vest I'll throw it on here and I'll kind of show you what it looks like on me um, but if I think I paid seventy dollars and I'm sure you can probably find a better price out there for it but overall great vest definitely recommend it well I hope you guys can see this hope you guys got enough light but uh, just to give you an idea, I'm uh, 5'11 and about 165 pounds, and uh, again, this I believe is a large size Rothko holster, and as you can see, it's tightened all the way down as far as it goes, so it won't go any smaller than this um, for me, but um, as you can see, the large fits me pretty well. Uh, it's pretty snug. I don't have any issues with it being too loose. Uh, when I do have all my equipment down here, my 9mm uh, magazines for my AR-15, additional magazines for my 9mm, and maybe some 22 ammunition if I got my 22 pistol with me. Um, all of that weighted on here, I don't generally have any issues with it. As you can see, I do have that uh, utility belt along the bottom here taken off. Again, I prefer that. It makes it a little bit more lighter, a little bit more fluid for me. It doesn't seem like it weights me down too much. So. Um, overall, it's a great fit as you guys can see. Uh, I don't have any issues with it and definitely would recommend it for any of you guys that are looking for a good tactical vest. If you have any questions, let me know. Otherwise, hope this helps and hope you enjoyed. Thanks, guys.